the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, love of God and the communion of the Holy Spirit be with you all. And with your spirit. We recognize right values. We also go for brands. That brand is good, this brand is not good. So once we get the taste of a particular brand, maybe the fruits or the vegetable or even the, the meat or the fish, so from that country, from that brand, so it is the best one. So we prefer that. In our spiritual life also we are called in order to choose the best one. So how do we choose the best one? Do we go for Jesus? Our best option that we have is Jesus. Today we also commemorate the memory of Saint Alfonso. So she chose the right thing, valued Jesus more than anything else and gave her life for Jesus totally and completely. So as we celebrate this Holy Eucharist, we ask the Lord that we may also experience Jesus as the highest value and value him and choose him beyond all other things. For all our failures, let us ask pardon from the Lord. I confess to, to Almighty God, God and to you, my brothers and sisters, that, that I have, have greatly sinned in my thoughts and in my words, in what I have done and in what I have failed to do, through my fault, through my fault, through my most grievous fault. Therefore I ask, bless Mary, the Virgin, all the angels and saints, and you, my brothers and sisters, to pray for me to the Lord our God. May Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Let us pray. O God, protector of those who hope in you, without whom nothing has firm foundation, nothing is holy, Bestow in abundance your mercy upon us and grant that with you as our ruler and guide we may use the good things that pass in such a way as to hold fast even now to those that ever endure. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. A reading from the book of Exodus. When Moses came down from the mountain of Sinai, as he came down from the mountain, Moses had, to, to, had the two tablets of the testimony in his hands. He did not know that the skin on his face was radiant after sp speaking with the Lord. And when Aaron and all the sons of Israel saw Moses. The skin on his face shone so much that they would not venture near him. But Moses called to them, and Aaron, with all the leaders of the community, came back to him, and he spoke to them. Then all the sons of Israel came closer, and he passed on to them all the orders that the Lord had given him on the mountain of Sinai. And when Moses had finished speaking to them, he put a veil over his face. Whenever he went into the Lord's presence to speak with him, Moses would remove the veil until he came out again. And when he came out, he would tell the sons of Israel what he had been ordered to pass on to them. And the sons of Israel would see the face of Moses radiant. Then Moses would put the wheel back over his face until he returned to speak with the Lord. The word of the Lord. You are holy, 
O Lord our God. Exalt the Lord our God. Bow down before Zion, his footstool. He the Lord is holy. Among his priests were Aaron and Moses. Among those who invoked his name were Samuel. They invoked the Lord and he answered. To them he spoke in the pillar of cloud. They did his will, they kept the law, which he, the Lord, had given. Exalt the Lord, our God, bow down before his holy mountain, for the Lord, our God, is holy. is a lamp for my steps and a light for my path. Hallelujah. 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 The Lord be with you. And, and with, with your, your spirit. spirit. Reading from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew. Glory to you, O Lord. Jesus said to the crowds, The kingdom of heaven is like treasures hidden in a field which someone has found. He hides it again, goes off happy, sells everything he owns and buys the field. Again, the kingdom of heaven is like a merchant looking for fine pearls. When he finds one of great value, he goes and sells everything he owns and buys it. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. To Jesus I surrender All to Him I freely give I will ever love and trust Him In His presence daily live I surrender all Pray, my dear brothers and sisters, that our sacrifice and our prayers may be acceptable to God the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of his name, for our good and the good of all his holy church. Accept, O Lord, we pray, the offerings which we bring from the abundance of your gifts, that through the powerful working of your grace, these most sacred mysteries may sanctify our present way of life and lead us to eternal gladness through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And, and with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift, we lift them, them up, up to, to the Lord. Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is, it is right, right and just. just. It is truly right and just our duty and our salvation always and everywhere to give you thanks Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God. For although you have no need of our praise, yet our thanksgiving is itself your gift. Since our praises add nothing to your greatness, but profit us for salvation. And so in company with the choirs of angels, we praise you and with joy we proclaim, Holy, 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 Holy Lord, Lord, God, God of hosts, 
heaven and earth are full of your glory. Hosanna in the highest. Blessed is you who comes in the name of the Lord. Hosanna in the highest. You are indeed holy, O Lord, the fount of all holiness. Make holy, therefore, these gifts, we pray, by sending down your Spirit upon them like the dewfall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of your Son, our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread, giving thanks, broke it, and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice, once more giving thanks. He gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it. For this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The Mystery of Faith this cup. We proclaim your death, O Lord. Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world. Bring her to the fullness of charity, together with Francis, our Pope, Paul, our Bishop, and all the clergy, religious, and your faithful. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection, and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, Blessed Joseph, her spouse, with blessed apostles, glorious martyrs, St. Francis of Assisi, St. Paul and St. Alphonsa, and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit to be co-heirs to eternal life and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him and with him and in him, O God Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Amen. With trust and confidence, let us pray to our Heavenly Father in the words Jesus himself has taught us. Our, our Father, Father, who art in heaven, heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Graciously grant peace and joy in our days, that by the help of your love and mercy, we may be always free from sin, and safe from all distress and anxiety as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Saviour, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, the power, and glory are yours, now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, you said to your apostles, I leave you peace, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church and our faith, and graciously grant us peace, joy, and unity in accordance with your will, who lives and reigns forever and ever. Amen. Peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. Let us offer each other the sign of peace. Peace be.
Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Grant us peace. This is Jesus Christ, the Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world. Happy are we who are called to the banquet of his love. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word, my soul shall be. Bless the Lord, O my soul, and never forget all his benefits. Let us pray. We have consumed, O Lord, this divine sacrament, the perpetual memorial of the passion of your Son. Grant, we pray, that this gift, which he himself gave us with love beyond all telling, may profit us for salvation. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And, and with, with your spirit. spirit. May Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Let us go in peace to love and serve the Lord. Thanks, Thanks be to God. God. Wish you a blessed day. God bless you.